Check it out. Check it out. Man, check it out. Nate McMillan has been let go for his 29 and 30 record start with the Hawks. Hawks are currently considering Quinn Snyder, Ime Udoka, Kenny Atkinson, and Charles Lee for the head coaching position. And truth be told, I feel as if it's a more underlying problem with the Hawks than just coaching. The basketball world, including myself, thought that the Hawks would indeed take a step forward since acquiring the versatile guard in DeJounte Murray, and that has yet to be the case with them. Even with Trey and DeJounte performing, this team still lacks something that can get them over the top, even with all the collection of talent that they currently have. The Hawks currently sit at 8th seed, and they're barely hanging on by thread to even maintain that and for a while everyone wanted to see Collins going but I feel as if they need to shake up the whole entire roster and that's including Trey Young clearly what they have isn't working and with them only sniffing one playoff appearance since Trey took over as the franchise player I mean at some point something just got to give maybe I'm being a little impatient but how many teams in the modern era who has this much talent was allowed to stay together longer than the Trey Young and Johns Collins ten and not sniff the playoffs at some point you just have to accept reality and get back a good return before it's too late in other news we have Miles Bridges who reported said he can possibly return by March. And this is huge news for the Hornets as I feel that this is another franchise who was derailed by Bridges off-court situation. Nonetheless though, if he can come back, lock in, I like this team going forward very much. I only wish that it would have came sooner as the Hornets sit currently 14th in the Eastern Conference and they have absolutely no chance of making this year's playoffs or play-in tournament. I'm wishing you the well though, Bridges, because I really do miss those crazy-ass acrobatic dunks you do. But y'all let me know what you guys think about the Hawks firing Nate McMillan. What you guys think of Miles Bridges possibly returning by the end of March and what that does for the Hornets going forward? Y'all let me know.